hope you're all well welcome back to my youtube channel and another haul um i've got loads of things to show you guys so i thought it was about time that i did another one i know it's not been long to my last one but i feel like she has so much stuff coming in at the moment perhaps it's like the changing of the seasons i don't know i've got more coming too so i don't think that it's gonna stop anytime soon um so yeah i'm not gonna go on for ages i'm just gonna get straight into it so if you haven't already i would love for you to subscribe to my channel um i do weekly fashion and styling videos i'll have background of like styling so hopefully yeah, you'll find them useful and interesting and like them my style is very much casual and neutral and simple um so i feel like it's something everyone really it's like everyday outfits is my jam so first i want to show you some things from one of my fave stores Arquette. I usually have some Arquette stuff in the haul. I really love their stuff so much um, and they do really good like good quality simple wardrobe staples um, so even though they are a bit higher price point than say like H&M and Topshop though sometimes Topshop can be quite pricey um, they are things that aren't going to go out of style and I do think the quality is a lot better uh, sorry, top shop. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I want to show you those. So the first thing is these trousers that I'm wearing. Stand here, so I'll put a clip of them there. Um, I really love these. They're so comfortable. Uh, it's a really nice fit. Oh, I've just realised that my zip's undone. Whoops. Um, but yeah, they're really nice. Oh, I can't read them out. I'm like, it's a really good fit. <laughs> okay, they're in. Um, oh, yeah, they're in. So it's a really good fit. <laughs> as you can tell um they're so comfortable to wear and they're actually really long so i think that this is like the start they're meant to be like kind of like pull down at the bottom uh, and because they go in they don't um they're not going to drag on the floor but uh, i've worn them with heels too it looks really nice and they also look nice rolled up a couple of times um so there's lots of different ways to wear them and i've actually got the blazer that matches which i'll put a picture in uh, and i love that blazer so much um and I've actually got it in black too, uh, so that's how much I love that. And this material is just really nice. Um, so yeah, maybe I need to get the black trousers too of these. But I think these are nice, and I wanted to get something different from Arquette because, and to like try out some of their other stuff because I've got a lot of knitwear from them, and I love their knitwear. And I've got a, the blazer which I love. Um, what else have I have from them? A fleece which I love. A lot of tops, top half things. I have got a pair of jeans and shoes in a bag. But yeah, a lot of top half things, but I love the jeans, so I thought oh, I'm going to try some of the trousers, uh, and I really like them, so yeah, I feel like I've ticked every box, tried everything in the store now, and I really like it all. The only thing I haven't tried, I think, is a dress, but I have got a dress in here, but like a proper dress, this is a jump dress, so I may as well I'll show you that now. Um, so this is the jump dress. It doesn't look like much here, but you'll be able to see it when I'm wearing it. Uh, and I honestly, I wore this for the first time the other day. And I mean, it's quite cold still here. But we had a day of sunshine. And when the sun shines, if you're not in the shade, it's actually so warm. And I wasn't cold at all. I wore it with bare legs and chunky boots, which is how I'll style it for this video. Um, and what I love about it is it's so oversized. So I've got a medium large uh, because I love things oversized, if you haven't noticed. Um... And I just love the drop shoulder. It's got this really nice little ruffle detail on the arms. Uh, and it comes to a really nice point too. It's just a bit longer than your average jumper dress. Um, it's like, like around knee length. Uh, and I think it's a really nice length actually for a jumper dress. Because it didn't feel like I was too exposed. And it still felt really cosy. I think that's probably why I felt warm. Is because it was still quite cosy. And if you're worried about being cold, I guess you could wear like cycling shorts and a t-shirt underneath as well. Or even another jumper. Another thing I got from Marquette, which I actually love and have shared so much on my Instagram stories already, is this um, off-shoulder jumper. It kind of is like this. It's like a V-neck off-shoulder situation. Uh, and it's so nice. It's a kind of ribbed material, like a thick ribbed. <laughs> that sounded wrong. Um, and it's this really nice, like almost like lemony cream colour. It's like cream, but it's kind of verging on lemony. Um, and it's so nice, it's quite long, so I actually styled it in my five ways to wear straight leg jeans the other day, um, and it looks really nice, long and not tucked in, like just to let it flow, uh, and I bet that would look really cool with cycling shorts as well when it comes to that kind of weather. Um, but it also looks really nice tucked in with jeans as well, so there's a couple of different ways that you can wear it, and it's just kind of, I like the fact that it's a, a take on a classic cream jumper, uh, it's just like a cream jumper with a twist. 
um, which I thought was really nice and I've just got so many cream jumpers so it's nice to find new reasons to add them to my wardrobe. Okay, so I've got a couple of accessories now and I'm obsessed with these sunglasses guys. Can we appreciate them? They're so cool. Can you see, if I do that I think you can see they've got an F on for Fendi and honestly I just think they're the coolest sunglasses. What I love about them is that they've got that kind of statement detail but they are still quite a simple kind of oversized glasses aviator style um, so they're not gonna, they're not like too attention grabbing and statement that you wouldn't wear them all the time um, so I think I would wear these all the time, I think they're so nice when you wear them pressed up against your face you do look like a fly but if you just like bring them down the nose a bit and do you know what someone was asking me this actually I think it was my mum and you can't see the F when like even if I look all around I can't see the F in the lens when I'm looking out so it's not like distracting or annoying or like gonna give you a headache from being like what is that and then another accessory I want to show you is the cutest thing ever is this little bag oh my goodness it's like smaller than my hand I think it's um it's from H&M I got it because I'm doing a little collaboration with them which I'm very excited about um and it's honestly the cutest thing it looks really good with outfits like this actually because look it's like the same color well it's not the same color but because it's got like the nudes and the blacks it looks really nice of a neutral outfit oh dear Penny's just got a hold of some tissue paper um, it's being very noisy let me throw it in the other room so at this point it's getting a bit mad but I have got another pair of jeans like honestly I have so many pairs of jeans but they're just so many good ones so these new ones are from H&M and I don't know what they're called but I will link them and everything else in this video below including what I'm wearing um let me have a look so I got them in a size 10 I don't know why I'm looking at the care label I forgot what I was looking for and then I was looking at it I'm changing to look busy and trying to remember what I was looking for. Oh yeah, the size, the style, sorry, not the size. So I got them in size 10, they fit me perfectly. Uh, I really like the wash of the denim. I love that it's got the yellow stitching. It's something I go on and on about. If you guys have been on this channel for a while, you'll know. I just think that it kind of makes something look way more, uh, it looks like an original pair of jeans, whereas I don't like jeans that have got blue stitching or white stitching I just think it makes it look a bit cheaper um, so they're a straight leg style which I love uh, and they've got that kind of can you see they've got that kind of grain to the denim um, that looks really nice they don't look cheap at all and they've got a really nice kind of high waist uh, which makes them ultra comfortable and the best thing about them in my opinion is I'm five foot seven ish Jack's always like you're not that tall and I'm like I am that tall he just thinks that he's taller than me and he's like that tall so he's like you're not that tall and I'm like with the same height get over it um <laughs> life story again um but yeah these are longer so they actually they're not like long long on me but they're not ankle bashes so like all my other jeans are kind of like ankle bashes or or cropped shall we say cropped jeans and they look good with boots they look good in the summer they look good all they look good all year round but sometimes you don't want a cold ankle so these jeans are perfect for when you want to not have cold ankles um, and I just think sometimes as well it's just nice to have a different look and I do think that that extra inch or so can make a real difference in a pair of jeans uh, and also I think they all look really nice folded up and I know that sounds crazy because I just said about cropped jeans but because I'm tall I never have the option to roll up a jean so what if I want to wear them cropped and have a roll up hey I don't have that option I don't have that luxury though I could just shop and get a 34 leg instead of a 32 hmm now there's a thought <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen the other thing I haven't stopped wearing are my joggers honestly these are so soft I think there's actually a food stain on them but I can't oh yeah here that's i think that's orange juice actually not a food stain i don't know if you can see it there um or pasta sauce or something anyway i basically love them so much and i do need to put them in the wash because it's got that food stain on but they're so soft on the inside that i'm worried that they might not be as soft when i wash them but i haven't stopped wearing these as well again like the other ones i've actually worn these out the house uh, they look really cool as trousers like I'm not normally the sort of person who wears joggers as trousers because I'm like 
I don't know, I just feel like I'm going out in my pyjamas. But I feel like because these are thicker and they've got this really nice um, detail around the ankle and it kind of, it just looks really nice that I have actually not felt uncomfortable going out in these, which is a dream because they're so soft and comfy. I actually feel like I'm going to have to buy a second pair so that when they're in the wash, I'll have them to wear like a kid in its blanket. <laughs> but I'm honestly addicted to these trousers. These, I might say are the best thing in this haul because i haven't stopped wearing them so i've got something very nice to show you now and it's from a brand that i've only ever had a couple of things from in the past and it's me and m uh so they are kind of like a luxury brand but a slightly lower price point i'm trying to think of a brand to compare them to maybe they're a bit reese vibe maybe a bit more than reese i'm not 100 sure on the prices so i'll link but i'll link everything below but yeah they're around that kind of price point as you can see it's new i haven't worn it yet uh, so this is very new and i am obsessed with the color of this it's such a nice kind of mint green as you guys know pastel is going to be a huge spring trend mint green is going to be a huge one i know this isn't mint green did i say mint green before would you call that mint green i don't know if it, or maybe it's more of a teal anyway pastel is going to be huge this is gorgeous i think this looks so nice with just like blue jeans and a white t-shirt or like denim shorts I think I'll be wearing this loads. I also think with like a little cream summer dress thrown over it. Um, so yeah, I love this. It's really good quality too. You can really tell by like looking at the finishing on it uh, and all like the buttons and everything. Look, can you see? It's just amazing quality. So I'm really looking forward to wearing this a lot this summer. And I have a couple of coats to show you. And I know that like we're kind of coming towards the end of the uh coat season though i feel like we've still got at least a month of wearing them in the uk but maybe towards the end of like them being in the stores um but i wanted to show you this amazing coat that i got from carl lagerfeld's brand carl is it called carl lagerfeld or just carl i think it might just be carl um but it's so gorgeous it's literally the softest coat and it feels really nice on like i don't know how to explain it other than just like the best fit ever like when it's on it just feels so comfortable i feel like i can move i feel like i feel like i can move easily and it doesn't feel restricting and it feels warm even though it's not a super thick i mean it is a, a w winter coat it's not like a thin coat but it feels almost warmer than like a puffer jacket or something because it just feels so well fitted it's really hard for me to explain what i mean but i love it it's also given me all of the balenciaga vibes with like the um shape of it and like all these details and the structured shoulders and things i think it looks so incredible then the other coat i want to show you is this one from everlane and this is quite a good one for going into spring because it's a really nice kind of light color so if you like me prefer to wear light colors and also if you live in an area like me where it's a bit cold still in the uk i don't know why i said area an area like the uk where it's still cold still um even in spring this is quite a good one because it's really warm and cozy but it's got that really nice like light feel to it it's also really lightweight it's like a quilted jacket but it's in stripes and cream when i first got it i was a bit like that looks like the inside of someone's duvet um and it kind of does but when you put it on it looks so nice um and i really like the fact that it's kind of colorless i just think it's quite a cool jacket it's very different to anything else i've really seen um anywhere to be honest um and i think i actually meant to get the green one um, but I ended up with this one and I think it's a blessing in disguise because I've worn this so much and I think I've actually worn it way more than I would have worn the khaki one so I'm actually really glad that I made that error and the first pair are these black boots from River Island these are just so soft it's kind of a joke they literally can you see how soft they are I'm like look how soft they are touch of vision I wish it was so you could touch them um but they're so soft and they've got this i really like this kind of like stitching detail instead of the elastic for the uh what do we call it like the chelsea boot bit 
Is that what it's called? Um, so they're like a Chelsea boot. They've got the white stitching, which I love. They've also got it around the toe, if you can see. That looks really nice. And they look really nice for, like, if you like me and don't like wearing heels that much. They're really comfortable, but you can still, they look nice for, like, going on night out with the girls and stuff. And finally, I have a few things to show you guys from Zara. And I haven't had anything from Zara in ages. And I saw one thing on their website and was like, holy moly, I need that in my life. And I had to get it and then I ended up making a whole order and that is this bag oh my goodness I am obsessed with this bag it is the cutest little thing it actually comes in pink as well but I just can you even cope with it it's so cute I adore it with the little daisies on it's so cute I love it and it comes in, yeah it comes in pink and two it was only 19.99 which I thought was crazy for cheap for a bag I know it is just like fabric but I feel like it's the sort of thing you'd see on shrimps or somewhere like it does actually look really unique in designer um so I was really shocked to see it at this price I think it'd be so cute with that like, little bag for like summer weddings and stuff and if you've just got a cute little summer outfit like a little white dress this will look so adorable with it uh, and I need to do a little photo shoot with it too for Instagram because it's like the cutest thing in the world. So something else I got, so something else I got was this really cute white shirt. And I got this because my sister actually has it. Um, and it looks so nice on her, open, as like a little jacket. Um, and I also really love the neckline that it's like a lower V. Um, but the main thing that I got it for was the collar because these collars are so on trend. Um, and can you see it's got like embroidery on it so the main reason I got it was for the collar because big collars seem to be on trend uh, for spring um, but the only thing I'm thinking now is that this one you can't really wear with a jumper because the whole thing is to wear them under jumpers it looks really cool uh, but then this one I don't know if you would but I still love it I think it will look so nice tucked into trousers like these um, and with the puff sleeves I just think it's a literal dream isn't it just adorable and it's like that kind of classic shirt material but you know shirt material that's a bit more comfortable and softer almost like cottony rather than that actual shirt material that's like work shirt do you know what i mean then finally is this contraption which i was just so confused by that i was like i've got to order that and see what it is so it's like you know how all of winter what's been really popular is the katie holmes look of uh, a bra a knitted bra with a knitted cardigan well i saw that zara were doing like a shirt bra with a shirt and i thought could this be the next big thing um and also i thought this is actually a really nice shirt anyway on its own and would look really cool as a kind of shirt dress and also i just wanted to see what was going on here and i think it was really it was 29.99 which to be fair is cheap for the shirt anyway but i thought it might look really cool so i want to kind of have a play around with it and i wanted to show you guys um but yeah i actually think that's a really nice bra too it's really cute like look it's this kind of little shirt material bra so we'll see I think it's really it's a really nice material it's really long it's a very long shirt I think I don't know if you could wear it as a dress or not we'll see but yeah I just really wanted to see what it was all about because it was just there was a few of them and they seemed to be all over Zara and I thought is this something that is coming or are they just trying to make the Katie Holmes thing happen and like continue and keep making money from it right up until summer that's probably the one. So thank you so much for watching my haul video. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know what you think of everything I got. Let me know what you think to the pieces I got. Which is your favourite store that I got things from, first of all. And second of all, which is your favourite piece that I got. I think my favourite from the whole haul has to be either the joggers or the fleece for comfort because I'm obsessed. Or, or this bag because I'm in love with it. I think the accessories one. Leave me a comment if you got to the end um, with an emoji of either clothes or some kind of accessory and then we'll see who wins, accessories or clothes. Was it a better for accessories or clothes? Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you found it useful and I've inspired you if you're looking to upgrade your spring wardrobe. If not, maybe you just enjoyed watching me blabber on for a bit. <laughs> thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch me blabber on. Um, 
and yeah if you do get anything and style it up i'd love to see it so make sure you like tag me or dm me on instagram i'll link my instagram below uh, and also remember if you want to see me style these things up then just go follow me because i'll be posting them every day on instagram um so thank you so much for watching i can't stop moving around i'm like thanks for watching my video hope you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe see you next time bye